Hello, I'm Colin Fallison, and here with the international LGBT news headlines from Pink 60. A court in the Lebanon has decreed that transgender people must be able to determine their own gender. In a landmark case, the judge ruled that people with gender dysphoria as a psychological condition must be allowed to seek treatment. Anglican bishops have silenced the Episcopal Church for the next three years over their acceptance of LGBT rights. Bishops chose to side with the anti-gay African communion rather than see them walk out over the issue. The head of an Australian organisation that imports PrEP for people who can't afford the full price has been forced to pay $1,000 to get the latest shipment through. Customs officers claim that as Philip Joffe was not the end recipient, the medication was not exempt from sales tax. Turkey's Pink Life Queer Fest is celebrating its fifth year with a new short film award as part of the wider festival. The event is split across two cities for the first week starting yesterday in Ankara. And finally, following claims of whitewashing last year, this year's Oscars sees a few LGBT nominations but little racial diversity. Anthony Hegarty competes with Sam Smith and Lady Gaga for Best Song, while stars of The Danish Girl and Carol are also up for an award. Well, that's all from us at Pink 60 for now. Join us again on Monday for the latest LGBT news headlines. And you can find out more about these and other news stories on our Facebook and Twitter pages by searching for Pink 60 News.